Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Stretch and Strengthening. Today, you're going to need a pair of uh, weights. So, but for now, for during our warm up, just leave your weights on your chair. Let's start out by taking a nice deep breath in and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Let's bring the shoulders up, back, and down. Bring it up, back, and down. Two more. Back and down. And up, back, and down. Let's pre uh, press our heels on the floor and bring the arms with. Warm up those joints. Warm up those muscles. Four more. Four. Three. Two and one. All right, keep tapping those heels. Let's make circles with the arms. And let's reverse it now. Reverse. Squats are next. All right, and squat here for eight. Remember to sit back. Six, five, four, three, two, and one, hamstring curls, looks like this. You're kicking your butt. Good, and tap your chest. Give me four more. Three, two, and one. Good, shrug your shoulders again. Up, back, and down. Up, back, and down. You should feel like you're warming up now. One more. Good, tap your heels. Arms are coming with you. Give me four more. Three, two, and one. Keep tapping your heels. Arms are up, forward circles. Good, and back. Hamstring curls are next. Tap your chest. Four. Give me four more. Three. Two. And one. Let's take it to a squat again. Two. Three. Four. Four more. Three. Two, and one. Grab your weights. Put them on the side of your right side. And let's kick them out to the side. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Bring the weight to the front. Lift the knee up and down. Three, four, four more, three, two, and one. Just hold the weights, bend the knee, and press back with the heel, squeezing our glutes. Our glute is the butt muscle, so it should look like this. Three, four, Four more, three, two, and one. Bring the knee up, press back. Knee up, press back. Knee up, press back. Knee up, press back. Give me one more. Good. Grab the weights, bring them together. Forward for four, up for four, two sets. Here we go. Bring it forward. Two, three, four. Bring it up. One, two, three, and four. Repeat that. Bring it forward. Two, three, and four. And up. Two, three, and four. Lower those arms to your sides. 
palms are facing your thighs, we're going to raise these arms up for four. Four, three, two, and one. Bring them to the sides, palms are facing the thighs, bring it out, elbows are slightly bent, two, three, and four. Bring it forward again, one, two, three, keep your abs tight, and four, out to the side, one, two, three, and four. Now press it back. Looks like so. We're squeezing the shoulder blades together. Squeezing in the back. It looks like this. Squeeze. Two. Three. Four. Four. Three. Two. And one. Good, let's go to the other side of the chair. All right, we're gonna start out with squats. Just cross those weights in front of you. Now remember, if during this it becomes too much, drop the weights. If that becomes too much, stop using your arms. Just use the lower extremities. Okay, just be safe when you're exercising. Let's breathe in and squat. Two, three, and four. Give me four more. Four, three, two, and one. Good. Bring those weights to the side on your left thigh and bring it out to the side and two, three, and four. Let's bring it forward for four. Bring it up. Two, three, and four. To the side again. Out. Two, three, and four. Forward. One, two, three, and four. Next is chest press. Bring the weights together. Press it out for four. One, two, three, and four. Overhead, one, two, three, and four. Again, chest press. Two, three, and four. Overhead, one, two, three, and four. Bring those weights to your side. We're ready to raise them up. Palms are facing your thighs. So we're gonna go four forward and four to the side. Elbows are bent. Remember, don't go any further than shoulder level. All right, here we go. One, two, three, and four, out to the side. One, two, three, and four, forward. One, two, three, and four, out to the side. One, two, three, and four. Now we're doing the uh, arm presses, squeezing the shoulder blades. The shoulder blades are your shoulders. So squeeze in between where your spine is. All right, here we go. Squeeze. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. And eight. Good. All right, let's go to the right side of our chair. Okay, we're gonna start out with squats with arms across the chest or in front of us. Here we go, one, two, three, four, four more here, 
three, two, and one. Weights in each hand. Here we go. Right arm up, left leg. Lift, 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 and lift. Give me four more. One, and two, and three, and four. Good. Elbows are bent. Bring them out to the side. We're bringing the elbows together in the middle and bring them back out. This is too much, drop your weight, okay? Here we go. One, two, three, and four. Good. All right, we're gonna do hamstring curls. Hamstring curls with a tricep kick back. It looks like this. Nice and slow. Three and four. Give me four more. Four, three, two, and one. Good. Bent over rows. You're bending, hinging at the hips. Palms are facing your thighs. Abs are in. Pull those weights towards the ribs. Two, three, four. Four, three, two, and one. Good, now lunge dips. I'm gonna turn this to the side so you can see what it looks like. Right foot forward, left foot back. Make sure that knee is behind that toe when you squat down, okay? We're gonna do hammer curls with this one. Here we go. One, two, three, and four. Give me four more, four, three, two, and one. Good, hold on to the chair, come on back up. Excellent. Now, triceps overhead, cross those weights. You, you can either use one or two. If you're gonna use two, cross them. Bring them up overhead, looks like so. Elbows are close to your head, and we're gonna raise it up. Straighten those arms and bring them down for the count of two. One, two, down, two. Up, two, down, and two. Up, two, 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 down, two. Give me two more. One, two, down, two. One more two, and down, two. Good, bring them, shake it out. Let's do some bicep curls here. Palms are facing away from you, elbows are to your side. Bring them up and down, nice and slow. Count for two, one, two, up, two, down, two, and up, two. This is four. Give me four more. Four, two, up, two, three, two, 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 and last one. Good, excellent. All right, let's take it and do a squat here. One, two, three, four, five, we are going to the left side in two more. And one, good, go to the left side. We've already done the squats. Left arm starts first, right uh, side. Here we go, lift, two, three, and four, Four more, three, two, 
and one. Good. Hamstring curls, hamstring curls with the tricep kickback. Here we go. Two, three, you can slow it down. Five, six, and last one. Lunges are next. Left foot forward, right foot back. Remember that knee stays behind the toe. All right, once you got that, add hammer curls. Hammer curls are palms are facing your thighs. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Four, three, two, and one. Good, come on up. Let's do triceps overhead here. Up and over, elbows are close to your, your head, and we're gonna come up for two and down for two for a count of eight. One, two, down, two, up, two, down, two. That's three, two, four, two, five, two, six, two, two more, and last one. Good, excellent. All right, if you need to take a glass of water right now, go ahead, I'll give you a little bit to do that. 30 seconds. I'm gonna get one, well, I won't get one. So just keep moving, whatever you do. And then we're gonna begin with um, squats. And then we're gonna do, we're gonna add a few more other things. All right, five seconds. Good, everyone, grab your weights again. And we're gonna start out with a squat. Here we go. Squat back and up, two and three, four, four more, three, two, and one. Good. Now we are going to raise the arms up like so and then bring them out to the side, bring them in and bring them down. Now remember, don't go any higher than shoulder level. Shoulder level's here, all right? Let's do eight. We're gonna, well, we'll, we'll split it up. We'll do four and then we'll do four presses. So here we go. One and two. Three and four. Good. Presses, elbows are bent. We're going to press it in for four. Three, two, and one. Scoot over, hinge over. Elbows are at your side, and you're going to press back for a tricep kickback. Two, three, four. All right, let's go back up to the top. Front raise, T, back to the middle, down, up, out, back to the middle, down. Two more of these. Last one. Good. Elbows are bent, shoulder height, and we're pressing in two, three, and four. Bend over, elbows at your side, straighten and bend. Straighten and bend, two more, and one. Good. Let's do squat and presses. I'll show you what it looks like, 
It's a squat and press back with the leg. Squat, press back, squat, press back, squat, press back. Let's do that. Let's do four of these. Squat, press back. That's one. Two. Three. That's four. Good job. All right, last one. We're going to do scap pulse. Looks like this. Elbows are here. We're squeezing our shoulder blades. We're going to pull it back and squeeze. Back and squeeze. Back and squeeze. That's four. Give me four more. Four. Three. Two. And one. Good. All right. Let's put those weights down. Do not sit down yet because your heart is pumping and I don't want you sitting yet. So we're going to take a nice deep breath in here. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Let's stretch out those arms. Let's bring the hand out like so. And take the other hand and press. Now this should not hurt, it should feel good. We just work the arms and the elbows and everything connected to it. So that should feel real nice. That's stretching the forearm. And make sure you're breathing during this time. Breathe in, nice and slow, and exhale. Now, take your hand, bring your fingers toward your forearm. Cradle that hand, and then straighten out that arm. Now you should feel this stretch right here in the front of that wrist. So again, curl the fingers toward the forearm, cradle the hand, and straighten up the elbow. Again, it should not hurt. If it's too much, just let go a little bit, okay? Let's take a nice deep breath in here. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Good. Now the other side. Palm is facing away. Other hand comes here and stretching the forearm. The flexors. This would be the flexors. And again, make sure you're breathing, giving yourself that oxygen you need as you're cooling down. All right, and now bring the fingers toward the forearm, cradle, and your elbow is bent during this time, and then straighten. And you should feel the stretch right here. Again, fingers toward the forearm, elbow is bent, and now Cradle with this hand and straighten. It's a good stretch. We don't stretch this enough. Good. Okay. All right. So let's take a nice deep breath in again. And exhale. Bring that arm across the body. Then take the other hand underneath and grab it and just hold that stretch. It's a nice stretch for the shoulder. You should feel proud of yourself. You did a nice workout. Instead of sitting on the couch. All right, other side. Bring it across to you and then stretch. Good, let's stretch those triceps. So bring the arm up and back. The hand is flat on the back. And then you grab your arm and stretch. Again, remember stretches should never hurt. If they hurt, back off. If they continue to hurt, stop. Good. 
Let's do the other side. Good. All right, by this time you should have cooled down a little bit. Go ahead and sit in your chair and we'll finish with our stretches in the chair. Now, what I want you to do is bring the, you sit at the edge of your chair, bring the heel on the floor. The toe is pointed up toward the ceiling. Nice tall posture. Now lean forward, bend at the hips. Keep your gaze up and you should feel the stretch in the back of the leg. When you do feel it, take a nice deep breath in. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Good. Bring that toe underneath your chair. Hold on to the armrests. Lower yourself down. And you should feel a stretch in the front of the thigh. That's your quads. Those are your hip flexors. If this is too much, just slide your toe forward a little bit to let off on the stretch. If it's not enough, get that, get that toe behind you a little bit more. And enjoy. Breathe in. And exhale. All right, push up on the armrests. Switch legs. Heel on the floor, toe toward the ceiling. Nice tall posture. Bend at the hips. Keep your gaze forward. Do not look at the floor. Then you tend to round your back and we don't want that. When you feel the stretch, breathe in. And exhale. Good. Bring the toe underneath the chair. Lean back. <clears throat> and enjoy the stretch. Breathe in. And exhale. Push yourself up. Come to a seated position. We're going to breathe in, and when we exhale, we're going to rotate to the right, stretching our spine. Ready? Breathe in. And exhale. Turn to the right. Hold here. Breathe in. And exhale. Breathe in, come center. Breathe out, turn to the left. Hold here for one breath, breathe in. And exhale. Breathe in, come forward. All right, let's bring the shoulders up, back and down. Bring them up, back and down, and up back and down. Grab that leg. Let's do circles with the ankles. Good. Let's grab the other leg. Let's do circles with this one. Excellent. Did a great job. Let's either cross your ankle over your knee or you can cross an ankle over an ankle, especially if you've had hip surgery or anything this one would be best for you to do. Anybody else? Cross your ankle over your knee. Nice tall posture, lean forward. You should feel this in your hip. Breathe in here. And exhale. Inhale. Exhale, switch legs. Lean forward, breathe in and exhale. All right, you did it. Take a nice deep breath in and exhale. Great job, everyone. We'll see you at the next class. Just keep moving. Bye-bye.